guys? It's Todd from the Todd and Tommy channel. I'm here with episode 3 of the Aria Craft series. Hooray! Anyway, I figured out a way to make it less laggy, which is hard to explain, but yeah, look, it's not laggy anymore. Hooray! So, let me show you spawn again, but, like, it's not laggy, so you can see everything. Look at how good this is. Hey, look, somebody joined. Welcome back. Oh, the wire is in my way. Okay. Um. So yeah, today I'm going to be showing you... Oops, I forgot to start the timer. Today I'm going to be showing you a bunch of stuff, probably. Let's see. I had figured it out in my head earlier, but now I don't remember. Let me see. I was going to show you... Oh yeah, I was going to show you the jail. That's what it was. Okay. So, this is... If you ever break the rules on the server, then you go to... We send you to this jail. So, welcome to the jail. Go laugh at the people who chose not to follow the rules. Let's hope you don't end up here. Have fun. I've been here several times. Not in jail. <laughs> I mean, I've been here to visit people in jail several times. And I've jokingly jailed myself because I'm allowed to do that, even though I'm not technically. But I still did. Yeah. So anyway, here are the cells. There's jail one. And it says something back there, but I can't read it. Bad player, something like that. There's jail two. That says something too. Jail three. This is what we call the Shia Jail, if you've heard of Shia LaBeouf, however you pronounce that. He's like, just do it. This is like, don't let your dreams be dreams. Stop giving up. Don't go to jail. Just do it. Blah. So yeah, we call that the Shia Jail. Shia. I don't know how to pronounce it. I call it Shia Jail. There's Jail 5, which is just normal. And Jail 6, actually, they're lava jails, so you can burn people to death, watch them suffer, and then when they respawn, they'll respawn in the jails, so they cannot escape. Then there's the fire charge jails, which, um, yeah, it just kills people immediately, probably. And then there's the TNT jail, which is my personal favorite. Um, we put them in there, there's a button down there, We and then we press it, and we blow them up, and they die. You must, it says, like, something like, you must have really done something bad to be in here. Yeah. Then there's the... PMC jail, PB in jail actually, but it's where we put people who say that they're from Planet Minecraft and they're like, I'm here to test some bugs. I'm from Planet Minecraft and I need to ask a few questions and they're always lying, so we send them to jail right away. And then we have this thing, which I don't think you can hear right now, but it makes a bunch of bat noises and it's really annoying. And then they eventually leave or just turn down their volume, but we just keep them in there because. We don't care if you're from Planet Minecraft. Because you're not. This is serious Black. I did my years of waiting. My ten years of waiting in Azkaban. And I don't know what this is. Then there's this jail. What is this? Oh, it's Azkaban. I don't think it's anything. Wait. Oh, it just sends a bunch of bats. I don't know. I didn't know about this one for some reason. I mean, I knew this was here, but I didn't know what it was for some reason. I don't know. So yeah, that is the jail. Hopefully you don't end up here. If you do come here, it'll just be to like look at people and laugh. That's what I do. It's very fun. Then we have, um, we have a police station, but no one really goes to it. Oh, it's raining. But yeah, it's it's a really cool looking police station. There's no real point in it. It's just to look cool. There you have it interrogation room which I'm not gonna go in because it's dark I don't like the dark it's scary then they have, they have a bunch of coffee and donuts and then there's a bunch of offices in here like that look this is Emily's office she's in Austin's office they're the two owners of the server I guess man I love this not lag because they were so laggier than that one time but both those times actually Anyway, now to the banned graveyard. So, if you go to jail, you might end up getting banned. So, if you're banned from the server, you can't ever come back. So, this we put everyone who has ever been banned on the server in here. So, welcome to the banned burial ground. Most people who get banned end up here. Oh, most. Okay, not all. I don't know why some people don't. Follow the podzol, whatever that is, to the start of the heads turnaround. So, this is podzol. Nice. Okay. So, the total people who have been on the server is 1,323. That might have changed by now. I don't know. She just changed it recently. Total people who we have banned is 175. People in the graveyard are 59. Huh. 
So we don't have, we only have like half of the people in here. I wonder why we don't have some people. Probably because like, we forget. And as in we, I mean Emily, the owner. Or Austin, but Austin never does anything. Just kidding, I didn't say that. So we remodeled stuff. They're now in order. Blah, blah, blah. So I'm not going to look read through everybody because like all 59 of them have explanations. But like you can see that a lot of people have been banned. And they all have their explanations for why we banned them. Most of the time it's just they were annoying. They didn't follow the rules. They asked for staff right when they joined the server. So if you want to join the server, don't do that. See, I'm giving you guys tips so you don't end up getting banned when you join, if you joined. So yeah, there's a lot. There's this one guy who has a very long explanation because he's actually he actually played on the server for a long time before he was banned for some reason. I don't know why he was banned because I wasn't actually here at the time. Uh, because multi-accounting. I don't know. You know, I don't even care. <laughs> multi-accounting isn't allowed. I told you about that. So this is the same person, QWERTY and ZXCV, which is funny because like those are the letters on the keyboard in order. Yeah. So yeah, that's all. Uh, this is almost filled up, but Emily's making another one. Or she already did. Let's see if there's a warp to it. Nope, warp sign will go here. Okay. But yeah, we're almost filled up, filled up already. Lots and lots of griefing poor hidden block. Hey, wait a minute. Hidden block is my town, which I'm going to show in a later episode. I didn't know he... Actually, I didn't know that. Never mind. Well, I knew someone griefed. I didn't know who it was. Who is this guy who doesn't even say his name? Emily, why didn't you write his name? Maybe she forgot his name. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, wait. It does say that name, doesn't it? It does say the name. I'm dumb. C.J. Albi. Oh, yeah. I remember him. He was annoying. Even though he, I never saw him. I'm lying to you. I always lie. Okay. So that's the band graveyard. Next, I'm going to show you the library. Because the library is a pretty cool place. So this is where you can read other people's books and, or submit your own book. You can like write a book and then submit it down here. There are a lot of books here so far. We even have a restricted section for like books that may be inappropriate or too hardcore for you. But there's only like three or four books in here. Five books. Yeah. So anyway, yeah. There's a bunch of books. That, what does that say? A Story of Life. Austin Story. Aria Office 3. Aria Office 2. Aria Office. Oh yeah, Aria Offices. It's by Matt Stat. Yeah, there's, so yeah, there's a bunch of books here. I have a bunch of floors too. I wrote some books. See, look, there's my head when I used to have a fish costume. I don't anymore, but I used to have a fish costume because of reasons. I wrote a book, a Minecraft story, which I also that I wrote it on Wattpad too, and that that's just actually a preview to it. But if you guys have Wattpad, you should check out Radishologist. See, that's my name there. Um, I wrote a book on it. It's called a Minecraft story. You should go read it. It's pretty cool. I have like 20 something thousand reads on it. I remember in my first Hunger Games thing, I was, I told people about it and I was like, yeah, it's pretty good according to my brother. I have like six reads. <laughs> now I have like 26,000 reads. Yeah. So I'll show you guys. I can become famous. Just kidding. I'm not famous. I don't know. I don't think there are any books up here. Anyway, this is the top. No, it's not. Hold on. And then the top floor of the library is a in free enchanting table. Oh, wow. There's more. How many floor? Okay, this is the top floor. So, yeah, there are free enchanting tables. This is level something. I don't know. Here's, the, yeah, the highest level. Level 30. If you have level 30 enchants, you can enchant here. And then there's free anvils. Or, yeah, free anvils. Free enchanting. Actually, you have to bring your own lapis lazuli, but yeah, it's pretty cool. So you don't have to, like, go to all the trouble of making one yourself. Yeah. Alright, what else was I going to show you? Um... I'll show you Staff City another time. Library parkour, PvP. I'll show you guys that next time. Parkour and PvP, probably. Yeah, next time. Maybe. I don't know. I'll show you all this next time, probably. Okay. 
Wait, there was... I saw one thing that I was going to... Oh, yeah. Statues. So I'm just going to show you guys this real quick. So the statue... They made, like, huge statues of themselves. That's Austin. That's Emily. These are their old skins, though. They don't have these skins anymore. And there's Hammy. And then there's... Punkish Rogue. And there's not me or Matt. Because we're not technically staff. We're staff-ish. And also, we never asked for statues. They could make us statues if we paid them, probably. But yeah, it, it's a really cool place. Yeah. So, I think I'll end it there for today. Next time I'll be showing you guys the parkour and PvP arenas, which is really cool. Look, they turned into Steve and Alex again. This happens to me a lot. I don't know why. Oh, right. Oh, I want to show you guys. Oh, yeah, so this is these statues here are new. We just figured out how to do those. Well, Emily just figured out how to do those. It's supposed to be there are statues there. But anyway. Look, it's... Oh, it's Alex again. Darn it. Okay, but that's usually me. See, it says Radishologist. I, I would log out and then log back in. Actually, I'm going to do that real quick. Okay, there we go. See, look. They have our statues because we're the helpers. She wouldn't put us in here because... Um... Because, I don't know, we were being annoying. So she just put us out there. Look, there's still Steven Nax. What is this? Alright, so anyway, yeah, I'll end it there for the today. Uh, thanks for watching, guys. And I'll see you all next time.